Hello, Menno here. Uh, it is September 29, 2025, and we just released an update to our M3 plugin. This is going to be version 1.0.4, and what we added, it's not much, but it's something that you've all been asking for and something that will make using M3 even faster and more fun. What we added was the ability to arrange all of your modules with just the click of a button by color or by group. Okay, so if you go under your settings, uh, just below toggle grayscale, you now see order satellites, and that will be by color or by group. If you select by color, you can see that all of the modules have now reordered themselves by color, and it's from lightest to darkest. Okay, so on your color palette, it will be lightest to darkest. All right, now if you select order by uh, group, it has now rearranged your modules by group. And when it does this, it does so in alphabetical order. So <laughs> I'm a control freak when it comes to my own stuff, you know, in a good way. And so in order to control this, all you have to do, you know, to really control your, your, um, your alphabetical order, because we don't want bass before drums or, you know, regardless of how you name them, we want them in a specific order. So if you number them, so I did one drums, two bass, three guitars, four keys, and so on and so forth, just number however, whatever order you want. When you do that, you will see that our drums are first. So our drum group is first. Um, our bass group is going to be second, and this is anytime you do this, boop, this is how it will it will put them in order. All right, so your bass will be second, uh, guitar will be third, and so on and so forth. Okay, let's go back to drums. Now, within each group, it will also arrange your uh, modules in alphabetical order. So again, you can really keep control, have control over how how you want them because remember when you're naming your modules and your tracks you could name them random names so anything that's in alphabetical order though they could be just scattered so if you do a prefix of a b c d now you can and that's within that group you can see that they all of our drums will come up in the order that i want every single time okay um in bass we have um we did A, B, C, D. So for each group, you have a prefix of A, prefix of a B, C, D, whatever. And that way, even when you're um, adding, because uh, you're going to add modules, take, uh, take away modules, move modules, whatever. But even within drums, you have A, B, C, D. Well, what comes before D? C. What else comes before D? C1, C2, C3, C4, C5. So you have nine Cs before D. So when you add a new one, if we want to do moon mic um, effects, we would just add a module, and it doesn't matter where it's at. I have put in parentheses there as a prefix, C1, and then um, because it'll do C before it does C1, and then arrange by group, and bloop, you'll have moon mic and then C1 will be moon mic effects, and then D. So very quickly, even if you have a, a, a mix where you've got like 75, 100 tracks, and you add a new module, it's a new M3, it's going to be, the module's pop, going to populate at the end. Just name it what you need, you want it, you know, wherever you, you need it, excuse me, and want it, arrange by group, and it'll just slide right there. So with a quick uh, click of a button, and then you're moving on, all right? So that's what we added to version 1.0.4. Uh, we are going to be adding many, many more features. This is just a quick one that I wanted to get out to you uh, as quickly as possible. Um, but we are adding many more features. And like I, I always tell you, IIAC updates are and shall always remain free. So as we add updates, you'll just download, install, and enjoy. Always. When you own M3, you own M3. COS Pro, Auto Demasker, same thing. Okay. So happy mixing, enjoy the new feature, and uh, I'll talk to you soon.